welcome back. I got this iPassport keyboard and several people have been asking me like, hey, I'm having some troubleshooting issues. Um, I also follow you on the Rojas Streaming Tech YouTube channel. Um, if you guys haven't checked that out, check that out. I do just streaming related stuff. With the tech channel, I try to give you guys some of the cool stuff and how to troubleshoot if something doesn't work. Now, with this keyboard, some people have been saying they've been plugging in the USB and it does not work. What do I do? So I'm actually going to show you guys that right now. So here is your FN key. And here is that little, uh, it's kind of hard to, to see right there, but that little, looks like a refresh button or like a circle button right below the escape button right there. You want to push that button, hold, hold that FN key. And then when you click on this, it's going to switch over to red. Make sure that light is on to use your receiver to use this USB receiver. If you plug this into the Mikul, NVIDIA, your computer, whatever, you need to be sure that if you click on any button, that little red light is on. That means it's going to connect to this. Now, let's just say you're like, well, I don't have a USB because I'm on a Fire Stick. If you push that button again, that FN, and if you come right back to this button again, it's going to switch over to the blue one. So let go, and right now it's not highlighted because I do have it connected, and I'll show you guys here, to my NVIDIA Shield. I have it connected to my NVIDIA Shield. Now, if I do, if I were to click that off and say, okay, I want to go back to, uh, I want to go back to my USB, notice it says it's now disconnected. Now, and if I'm clicking, it's not going to work. The cool thing is, is I already have this thing connected now, so I have it, as soon as I turn it on, it's going to be connected. Now, how do I connect this thing to a Fire Stick, for example? Use your, use your Fire Stick remote, go all the way over to settings, come down here to controllers and Bluetooth devices, go to other Bluetooth devices. Now, as you can see, I already have this one here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to select this to unpair, and I'm going to select confirm, so it's gone now, and I'm going to go ahead and click Add Bluetooth device. Now, before I click on add Bluetooth device, I want to be sure I am on that little blue button and it looks like I'm still on red. So I'm going to go FN. I'm going to click on that button, make sure I'm on blue. So now my Bluetooth button is on. Notice I'm moving it. Nothing's connected. So I'm going to go back to my Fire Stick, click on Bluetooth. There it is right there. Bluetooth keyboard, come down, select it. Give it a few seconds. It's going to say you are now connected and now I should be able to use this remote. So pretty easy. Look at this. Like this thing works amazing. Really, really good. So I wanted to give you guys like that troubleshooting video just in case because I did have a few people that were just like, I'm confused. I don't know how to fix it. I saw you do it on the other channel. Um, so hopefully this helps you out. Very, very simple and straight to the point. This thing works amazing. Again, you could go USB or you could go full on Bluetooth. Hope you guys have gotten some information out of this one. You guys take care, take care of each other, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Take care, guys.